OGSB is the leading manufacturing facility of IMS Group. The company specializes in the field of design, construction and supply of equipment used in oil, gas, refining and petrochemical industries to Russia and other countries around the world. Company production staff and technologies are certified to perform work according to Russian and international standards ASME and EN. The quality management system is certified by one of the recognized leaders in the field of standardization, certification and supervision, Lloyd's Register Quality Assurance. One of the company products is the Pipeline Surge Relief System or PSRS. The PSRS is a piece of safety equipment that protects liquid transport pipelines from surge pressures caused by a sudden change in fluid velocity. Without surge relief, these surge pressures can damage pipes, other piping components, equipment and personnel. Pressure surges can be generated by anything that causes the liquid velocity in a line to change quickly, for example, valve closure, pump trip and emergency shutdown valve closure. Prior to the activation of PSRS, the oil pressure at the inlet of the pump station is less than the nitrogen pressure on the control side of the system. All the pressure relief valves are closed. A pressure surge in the upstream line of the pump station, which is normally caused by shutting off one or several pump units, causes the pressure on the inlet to the surge relief valve to exceed the nitrogen control pressure, resulting in the quick opening of the surge relief valve, relieving sufficient liquid volume to eliminate the surge. At the same time, oil flows into the separator vessel. This pushes antifreeze into the hydropneumatic accumulator. The flow of antifreeze is regulated by a control valve. The flow of antifreeze causes an increase in nitrogen pressure on the control side of the relief valve P2. When the nitrogen pressure P2 exceeds the line pressure P1, the valve shuts. The gradual increase in control pressure results in the smooth closure of the relief valve. Oil flow through the relief valve is registered by flow switches installed at the outlet of each valve. The flow detection signal from the relief valves is sent to the pump station control room. This film will show you all the stages of PSRS production by OGSB. Production of each PSRS package begins with the development of design documentation to comply with the required pressure and flow rate conditions given in the customer's project specification. Each PSRS is handled as a unique project and specifically designed to be in full compliance with customer specification and transport pipeline diagram. Prior to commencement of manufacture, OGSB provides the customer with a quality plan for approval, which outlines the processes employed by the company to control the quality of the materials from good inwards inspection and during each stage of manufacture. Our in-house non-destructive testing laboratory is staffed by Level 2 and Level 3 engineers. All materials must pass the inwards inspection upon the entrance to the facility to check the compliance with the quality requirements. Then the manufacturing process begins. The OGSB Quality Control Laboratory has all the necessary equipment procured from world-leading manufacturers to perform different tests. Well joints of the PSRS are subjected to visual, radiographic, ultrasonic, dipenetrant and magnetic particle inspection. All materials must pass the inwards inspection upon the entrance to the facility to check the compliance with the quality requirements, then the manufacturing process begins. The first stage of manufacturing process focuses on the preparation of the process and structural components. The components, separation vessel, pipework, supports and skid base are welded in a dedicated welding area. Welding processes, argon arc, semi-automatic and automatic welding, are chosen to suit materials, pipe size and wall thickness. All welding is controlled by the use of welding procedure specifications developed by OGSB. When the PSRS process components are welded and tested, the system is pre-assembled. Separation vessel, pipework, hydropneumatic accumulators, relief and shut-off valves and modular building are mounted on the prefabricated skid base. After the pre-assembly of PSRS, process equipment is subjected to test. The aim of these tests is to check and verify the compliance of product characteristics to the specification and to acknowledge its fitness for intended use. 
process equipment testing comprises two stages. The first stage involves the testing of the relief valves, main system components. Surge relief valves are the core of the system used to control pressure surges in fluid systems. Our company employs world-class practices, technology and equipment to manufacture the PSRS. The surge relief valves are supplied by M&J Valve as part of the license agreement with IMS Group. The valves are tested to prove the quick opening of the valve under surge conditions and valve closing time. The activation speed of these valves is used to prove the capacity of one or a group of the valves to relieve the surge within an acceptable time period calculated by standard hydrodynamic calculations. The surge relief valves remain closed when line pressure P1 equals nitrogen control pressure P2. When the nitrogen control pressure is less than the line pressure P1, the surge relief valve opens. When the nitrogen pressure exceeds the line pressure, the valve is closed. The first stage of testing involves the hydro-testing of each valve. The adjustment of the valve takes place at the premises of the manufacturer. The second stage of testing is hydropneumatic testing comprising hydraulic and leak tests of the system piping. The aim of these tests is to ensure system integrity and absence of leaks. When the system is leaked tight with no pressure drops revealed, all process fluids and gases are drained. The system is dismantled and all the structural and process components are subjected to short blasting. Abrasive blasting is a surface preparation process using steel grit to clean the surface from corrosion, scale and deposits. This process is a critical part of surface preparation for painting and is a requirement to achieve good adhesion between the coating and metal surface. After blasting, the components are subjected to surface roughness tests and quality tests. After painting, the PSRS components are returned to the main workshop for final assembly. The final assembly includes the PSRS modular building assembly, process equipment, heating, lighting, gas detection, visual and audio alarms. After assembly, the PSRS is subjected to a visual inspection to verify the compliance with design documentation and technical specification. The test is performed by inspectors of NDT laboratory and representative of the customer according to the quality plan approved by the customer. After final assembly and testing, each PSRS is prepared for transportation. The system is dismantled into modules of the correct dimensions for shipping. These modules are treated, sealed and packed to prevent damage and corrosion during shipping and storage. Pressure surge relief systems designed and produced by OGSB and IMS Group have been operated successfully by major companies such as Transneft, Rosneft and the Caspian Pipeline Consortium. Our Kaliningrad manufacturing facility is the largest of four manufacturing facilities within the IMS Group. OGSB manufactures the finest quality equipment using unique technologies, professional staff and partners all over the world.